Hello everybody, welcome to The Sims 4 Creative Sim Demo. Now I know last time I said this wasn't going to be a series, but I did get a comment saying that they liked it, so I will be doing another one of these. Maybe I'll have a few more in the future, but you know, as long as you guys enjoy them, I'll keep doing them. Uh, these are more of a tutorial than actually, well not really a tutorial, but it's kind of showing you the process of me building a sim. They don't really explain it very well. I'm still sick. I uh, actually have to blow my nose one sec really quick. Uh, better. Alright, so we're just going to click play, and I have a celebrity right off to the side of the window that I'm not going to show you yet. Oh, that's perfect. That's actually a perfect face to start on. All I have to do is just adjust the face a little bit, and then it'll be the person. Well, you know, maybe a little bit more adjusting and stuff. Alright, so I'm just going to show you the person. Ariana Grande. Yes, when we do Ariana Grande. Today. Sorry. So here's what we're going to do. This is a good skin tone to start off with. The hair, though, is a no-no. She wears it... Kind of... In like a ponytail sort of weird style. I don't know if it's in this or not. Is that it? Yeah, that's exactly it actually. No, let me just change the colors. It's a little bit dark. Yeah, look at that. Oh, darn, I have to rotate the head. But yeah, that's good. Let's get Ariana's picture in here. It's, it's sort of like that. So yeah, that's it's good for the hair. Alright, now I'm just going to start molding the face a little bit. First of all, this jawline needs to come down a little bit, and these cheeks need to come out. And then this has to go in. And then this has to come out a little bit. She has kind of... A very odd shaped face, like her cheeks are the widest part, obviously, of her face, but they're not too wide. They're just wide enough, and then her chin is kind of big, but not really. Uh, just keep that looks good. For a basic gist, the lips, I will just slightly adjust. Cause they are pretty spot on, but that looks nothing like it. That looks nothing like it. She has smooth, sort of. They're not that small though. They're like that. I have to adjust them. She's always smiling. And exactly that wide of a smile that just kind of looks creepy close your mouth why is it open I don't like it. is, is that open yeah it's ever so slightly open open whatever uh, oh ho 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 uh, no those are wrong I think we'll just have to go with these ones and then just bulk them up a little bit. A little bit like that. A little bit more sensible. That looks a little bit more sensible. Uh, I do say so myself. A little bit more sensible. These cheekbones aren't really doing it for me. So I'm just going to slide these in very slightly. Maybe make her jaw a little bit shorter. But she does have dimples. I mean, her face is very... I 
It's weird. Sort of make dimples like that, but you know. She's a very indented and outdented sort of face at the same time. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna click around a little bit and try and even it out as best as I can. And I'm no, I'm by no means a professional at making sims, but you know, I do have some experience, so. Right now I'm just trying to do some really small little clicks to have like tiny adjustments. And that's starting to look okay. But you just need to come out a little bit, and your jaw needs to go back a little bit. Chin, it's good. The lips, pretty good over there. And now your nose, which is actually pretty much the same. Although I'm going to change it very slightly. It's not very slightly. That's that's more like it. And then just sort of adjust your mouth. Is, your eyes are usually a little bit lower on your forehead. Can I move those down? Or do I have to move this up? Your pupils are pretty big too. Or your iris or whatever. Oh, now this face is just starting to look weird. The jawbone has to come out a little bit. And the chin has to go... <coughs> in. No. Jawbone in. Chin out. Looks weird. Jawbone out a little bit. Cheeks in. Uh, has to widen a little bit. Whoa. No, no, no. <laughs> Alright. Let's take another look. I don't know if the shape of your face is good. It's just, is there a shape? Some faces and stuff. Your chin's kind of. Nah, it's, it doesn't really have a mark on it, but. It's, yeah, it's pretty distinct like that. And then your jaw structure. Kind of weird. But that that's a good base to start with, I think, better than the other one. So that's adjusting that. So that has to come down like that. And these have to come in like that. Well, this has to come out. Oh, you have a weird shaped face. that bigger mouth maybe uh, she doesn't have that big of a lip and she doesn't have that big of a smile either cheeks No, that's not what we want. Uh, like that. And maybe the jaw down. Ooh, that's perfect, actually. Just the jaw down a little bit and the chin. Uh, did that give her a double chin? Uh, and then all we have to really adjust is cheekbones. Fairly distinct, but not so distinct. Is that good? That is good, in my opinion. Although her nose is too far up and stuff. How did we move the nose down last time?
these eyes are all messed up. I'm not trying to do those yet. She has a more compact face. Like, her eyes are just, like, down a little bit. Okay. Oh, I didn't select the mouth. I selected the eyes. That's a good color. She does wear a lot of makeup, though. Those might be slightly better to work with. Well, she doesn't wear that much. She has eyelashes, though. Which is one of those Sims seem to really have eyelashes. Well, just like this Cindy Lauper song, it is good enough for me. So yes, that is that's good for now. All right, I think I slid them down just a little bit. I think. Her lip doesn't really have a natural curve, though, so... Yeah. It's more like that, to be completely honest. And then just bring that into up into like a nice little smile. Bring that down, bring that in a little bit, and that looks pretty good. Eyes are pretty big. Not that big though. How's the neck? You guys haven't seen her picture for a while, so I'm actually just gonna take out the picture again. Really, really quick. Do a quick comparison. So as you can probably see the cheeks are not quite there, so you know. Oh, I dragged the picture out of the way. That's perfect. Just a little bit more on the jawbone and a little bit less on the back. That's starting to look like a pretty good face. Oh, well, she's a little bit darker. Maybe more like that, I would say. Fix like her hair. <coughs> no, that's pretty good. That's from the makeup. What do we need? She doesn't really wear much eyeshadow. Lipstick she wears. Not that dark. Not that dark. Mm, darker than that. A little bit lighter than that. Not that light. <laughs> That's just funny.
that's the closest, I think. That looks pretty close. If I do say it so myself. Maybe we can just make this a little bit bigger. Like her lips in general. Not like fatter, but I mean like wider. Pull out! Out! <laughs> no, that's just a duck face, Ariana. Just a duck face. That looks... So those look too big. What do you guys think? I think they look a little bit too plump on the top. Or maybe it's just slight adjustments on the bottom. That looks a lot better. You probably can't see the whole picture. Yeah, that's good for the face. I don't like the eyeshadow though. So we're gonna have to fix up the eyes. Their eye corners, they don't sag like that. More compact. the eyes and all the eyebrows. Now, eyebrows are pretty... these are pretty close to what she has. At least in this picture. So, I'm just gonna slightly adjust them and then bring them up a little bit. And bring the point down. Are these better? because she doesn't have those type of eyebrows. These are pretty close. I'll have to do a lot of adjusting though. I'm gonna have to take those down. I don't know. These aren't very good. I think the other ones were better. Oh, why are you only showing half the screen to me? Show me the full screen. Light adjustments and then it's Ariana Grande's face. That's perfect. So how the face is done the hardest part. And now we have to get on to body shaping. Which is gonna be even harder because I don't think I have a shot of her body, really. Uh I do, but it's fairly zoomed in. I can't zoom out very far. Oh that looks okay. So, basic gist of it is, slightly tweaking the body that we had before, slightly enhancing, there. would be easier if you would stop moving there that looks pretty good except for a torso which is kind of 
kind of wide, skinny, wide. It's quite weird. So wider here, wider there, just a little bit uh, wider. There. So she has a weird sort of figure. That's close enough, I think. I have some clothing. Ah, uh, what would she wear? She has been on the red carpet and stuff. So maybe she'd wear like a full body dress. Ooh. I've seen her wear something like that before. <coughs> uh, she's she would I don't know what type of stuff she'd wear. That looks like it's something that she'd wear, but not that flashy. That's even more something that she'd wear, because she's kind of juvenile in a lot of ways. Oh! Oh my gosh, that's the exact same thing she's wearing in this picture. I'm not even joking you. That is what she's going to wear. <laughs> that is stunningly close. That had to be put in here somehow. So now that the dress is on, it's easier to shape. She's not that tall in the torso. Can I make her a little bit shorter? Or is that... Just how tall she comes. Uh, she's average, I guess I'd say. Maybe a little bit under average. Her torso is a little bit long now. Can I like drag the torso down or something? How do you adjust height? I don't know how to adjust height. <laughs> I don't even know if you can adjust height. She's not that tall. That makes her look a little bit more human. A little bit wider hips. Not that wide though. Just wide enough. That looks pretty good to me. I don't know if she'd wear Uggs though. So let's change that to like a high heel, because I'm pretty sure that's what she likes to wear. Got those in red. You don't, but you know, these are something that she'd probably wear. Yeah, those look good. Alright, well that was Ariana Grande. Her hair could be a little bit lighter, actually. Not that light, though. And not that dark. I'll keep it like that. So, yeah. Let's just compare that picture. Let's get out of detail mode. You can see everything looks pretty good. Side-by-side -side sort of thing. It looks pretty good. <coughs> I'm not a professional at making sims, so... Yeah. That's a pretty good look, I think. 
since her face is a little bit needs a little bit more cheekbones maybe a little bit more downwards sort of angle does that look a little bit better I think that looks a little bit better so yeah thank you guys all for watching please be sure to like comment and subscribe just let me fill in her attributions attributions or whatever aspirations food master chef uh, nature she's she's a loving person I guess so yeah let's put that in uh, cheerful yes uh, active I don't know probably romantic sure, sure. <laughs> that voice does not fit you in any way shape or form but okay so hello my name is Ariana Grande and now let's just save the household uh, I don't know I always feel like I have to write something clever in here but really I can just do that and that should be a good description so how would Ariana pose she always shows the left side of her face like you that is that the left side that's the right side that's a little bit better I think that would be a good sort of uh, I don't understand cameras so you know could be either side of her face but you know that looks good that looks good just save that so that is the grande household should have made Frankie too but I really don't feel like doing that any big brother watchers out there woo -woo. <laughs> so yeah thank you guys all for watching please be sure to like comment and subscribe and as always peace